What's up guys? We got the new Campo drop. It's live. We got new shirts, the championship ring shirt, the all team t-shirt. As you can see how it looks on my guys here. We got the new shorts just in time for the summer. And we got plenty of different colorways. The website is live. We have a discount code that you can get two items and you get a 15% discount. The code is CF2023. Use that at checkout. Yeah, man, just go cop that, man. We've been working real hard. To get this different quality, man. We got the tags on there and everything. Yes, this ain't no, this ain't a hang shirt, man. Yes, go sir. get that. We yes, work real sir. hard on these. Website's yes, live. Cardio family! Okay, apparently we don't go around and do all the topics. So somebody was all like, why, do I, why don't you guys do something like the gun topic? What do they call it? What is the like, real term? Control. Yeah, gun control. They so said you guys don't talk on real topics. You guys just talk about race and... That's a real topic. But yeah, okay. Race and gender. Let's What's talk about topics. gun control. I swear we talked about guns like, before. How is the view calling Neuer, Neuer? So apparently, man, who is this host? I've been seeing her a lot. I don't know, but she was the one talking about um how they tripped on killing dude. Yeah, on yeah. the train. Yeah, she, she be, she be, boy. So y'all don't know what show this is? It's The View. Oh, okay. With you Whoopi said, Goldberg and all them. I don't oh, know. okay. Yeah, Shannon yeah. Osbourne used to be on there. I don't know. Okay. From, from afar, she look like Wendy from back here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she yeah. look a little better than Wendy. Though. Yeah, for yeah. sure. Wendy look like a what's here. Yeah, she passed out. <laughs> all right, this says host from The View, embarrassers of themselves by debating AR-15s with Republican governor. Well, I'm interested they to see They about to try to gaslight that man. In the last um, 145 days, we've had 241 mass shootings mm. in this country. Why is she acting like there's only one definition of mass shooting? There are many different definitions of mass shootings. And it's been shown that one definition can create a far bigger number than another definition. For example, by Didn't one account, cry. there have been 68 mass shootings so far in 2023. By other accounts, there have been six or even fewer. These widely divergent numbers can create confusion in the wake of another tragedy. Saying that there have been more mass shootings than days so far in 2023 is truly scaring to people because yeah, that scary. relies on just one definition of a mass shooting. Four or more people shot, including injuries. And that definition is too wide, said James Allen Fox, a Northeastern University criminologist. And as governor, um, you've loosened gun laws in your state and you hold an A rating from the for the NRA. You know, I find it ironic that she brings up how this governor loosened gun laws in his state and has an A rating with the NRA, fails to mention he's the governor of New Hampshire, the safest state in the nation. You told a friend of our show, Jen Psaki, recently, there's no law you're going to pass that's going to stop mass shootings. There's no law you're going to pass that's just going to magically stop gun violence. However, there was a law that was passed. And that law was passed in 1997. It was a federal assault weapons ban. And it cut it, but 1994 rather, and it cut um, gun violence by 70%. And the mass minute shoot. it was reinstated, mass shoot. yeah. mass shootings, and the minute it was reinstated, they went up. Why yeah. not yeah. put that law back in? No, place? no, no. So let's understand. Once again, where did she get this stat from? And I quote, the federal assault weapons ban scheduled to expire in September is not responsible for the nation's steady decline in gun related violence and its renewal likely will achieve little, according to an independent study commissioned by the National Institute of Justice. We cannot clearly credit the ban with any of the nation's recent drop in gun violence. And indeed, there has been no discernible reduction in the lethality and injuriousness of gun violence said the unreleased NIJ report written by Christopher Coper, a professor at the University of Pennsylvania. It is thus premature to make definitive assessments of the ban's impact on gun violence should it be renewed. The ban's effects on gun violence are likely to be small at best and perhaps too small for reliable measurement, said the report, a copy of which was obtained by the Washington Times. The report also noted that assault weapons are rarely used in gun crimes even before the ban. NIJ is the Justice Department's sure. research development and evaluation agency assigned the job of providing objective and independent evidence-based information to the department through independent studies and other data collection activities. At this point, I'm convinced that Sonny just pulls these stats out of her ass. Look, if the argument is if we no just ban. have more gun bans and no, more gun laws, Chicago would be the safest place in the country. But the problem because they have the that, most restricted law. But the problem with that argument yeah. is that the, law, the guns that are used in Chicago are coming from states that have looser okay. gun laws. So, you know, I love it when anti-gunners make this argument because it's such an easy argument to defeat with one question. If the reason Chicago's gun violence is so bad is because of the loose gun laws in the surrounding states, why don't those same states have the same gun violence issues to the degree that yes, Chicago does? Clearly, there's a deeper issue that has nothing to do with guns. But 
to dive deeper into that issue will expose something that people like Sonny don't want to admit that most gun violence happens in cities led by Democrats. But they don't want to talk about that. But I will in a video in the that's, near future. Guys, I, I, I have what? the safest state in the country. Most gun violence happens in cities led by Democrats. Yeah. We can't say that. Well, because Baton Rouge, well, that is a Democratic city. Uh, yeah, we don't know that. I think it was yeah, bro, if you, it's blue. Like, uh, even though Louisiana is red, yeah. the county New Orleans is blue. New Orleans was both blue. Yeah. And, that's and I think most violent cities. In the, that's the two most, that's two of the most violent cities in the nation. What type of people are there? All right, so you, bro. Not that. But okay, can a mass shooting be like, Four people was killed? Three. Uh, I think three is considered a mass shooting. Well, that's a problem. Because, uh... Hey, hold up. Let's consider a mass... Yeah, I think it's three or two. I think it's more than I one. Think, it's I, think, I think it's three. I think you're right. So then that could be why... But I mean, that's still bad, though. Yeah, that's, that's definitely bad. But then the fact that one report had six, one had 60. 200. One had oh. 240. Yeah. You had, had you six, have, you, you had 240. I would say a mass shooting would have to be like six or more, bro. That would be a mass. But three, I mean, you know, well, three is still a lot. They're all bad. Man. They're definitely all bad, but I, I can see the correlation with the point he's trying to make. I think he said it, though. I think he said three. It says involving four or more victims yeah. in more than one one or more locations. So it's four people. Yeah, so Eric, if, that's great. if somebody shoot one bullet at us, that's considered a mass shooting. Oh, really? Uh, Wait, shoot at no, four people? Victim, well, you are a victim if you're shot at. Yeah. So, if one person shoot a gun at us, that's considered a mass shooting. Oh, wow. wow. That's crazy. Technically, what? it's involving four or more people, one or more locations close to one another. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's considered a mass shooting. If yeah. one, one person shoot. So, a someone shooting in an area with a lot of people is yeah. a mass shooting. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Wow. That's, that's so, you get the context on that, then you don't you understand. You don't think about a lot of guns, so gang skinny. violence, and then you know, all that. And yeah, so, so that's going to seem like a lot. So, yeah, like, that's a fight at a party. If that's the truth, I, that would, is, if that's what it is, I don't think it's more than that. To be honest, that I mean, would be why there's so the many. Because big, right? It's just people shooting in, in large crowded areas. But to say that it's been more, has it been more uh, mass shootings this year than yeah. we have? Yeah, take Do we it have it. days though. At yeah. the time, pretty sure. Yeah, that was this year that she said that. Yeah, I'm pretty. I'm pretty, I'm pretty yeah, sure. That's been more. Yeah, that was in like January, wasn't it? When this happened. No, that was two hundred and something days in. So so they they did say, they, she did say that it's been more. It's been more. It couldn't be right now because you know how many days it's been. But she said two hundred forty. No, but that's right now also though. In this year, it's been more mass shootings than. You sure? Yes. 202 mass shootings this year. January, February, March. April, we can't get a solid number. We took 202, 242, 66, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, I ain't gonna lie, it shows every What should we count as a mass shooting? Every That's state, the problem. every role, yeah, every... Wow, it says three on here. Three victims injured. Oh, yeah. one kid, yeah, it's four. Yeah, it had to be four people. It had to be four. Yeah. Is it? That's a lie. Oh, it's trying to be four killed or injured? Like four people as victims. It gotta have four victims. So do they have to be shot or shot at? Shot at or shot or injured. That's, 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 that's very interesting. It is. Guys, at the, I, I have the safest state in the country. You can talk about the, the validity, the merits of a law are based on the results it gets. I have the, the safest state in the country. So why are we having the mass shootings? It's not because people have access to guns. It's because we're not dealing with mental health. We don't provide access for mental health with kids. When people are in crisis, they have nowhere to turn. They resort to violence. We don't do the right things in terms of locking down our schools and protecting. What's wrong the with core getting, of the issue is why, the why is why are you holding on to this one gun? Yeah. What is it about this one gun? Yeah, a bunch of children who are just going to school. First of all, it's not just one gun. The assault weapon ban banned a bunch of guns. The AR-15 is just... It's yeah. not just women. Yeah, it's, 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 it's not, it's not, I think the uh, AR, the, uh, the so what the show bench can have full yeah, automatic yeah. guns. Isn't that what it bans? Like fully automatic guns? Yeah, you can't have one minute. Yeah. Yeah. I think the assault, the ban they're talking about is that has been lifted since. That ban is still like, you still can't have automatic guns technically. But the boy he was talking about, they was going to take away like, all ARs and all oh. assault style weapons. Well, I mean, uh, uh, 
I, I mean, that's it. impossible, though. Yeah. It's yeah, too many. Stop it, though. Yeah. We can stop selling it, but... But that's, that's just going to hold people people already I mean, that's going to cost more. I mean, yeah. People are going to make a bag if they stop selling them. Bro, you can go to a freaking gun... Uh, What are those things called? Gun show? There was one time I went to gun show in Oklahoma. This dude had literal notebook paper. Personal collection. No papers. Be, uh, was it best offer? So, uh, but is that good for the country, offer? though? I'm just Let's saying, be real. That's crazy. Let's be 100% real. He had a table full of... Is that good for the country? Now, it's good for your home and your safety. Being, being able to protect I, I was just saying, like, that type of that, like, I mean, that, just, just the fact that you could go buy his gun off him and just have it legally. Is that he safe? had AKs. Is that safe? Oh, hell no. So you has got to be some type of regulation put in place, like, to make it where it's harder to get guns. Because when you limit the access to them, you're limiting who can get them. So it's harder to access or make it more, make it more expensive like, to get them. Yeah, it's two Yeah, it's then It was harder to get them, but someone good is trying to get one, it's harder for them to get one. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, though. Like, But if someone's good is trying to get them, they'll go through the proper channels to get one. Yeah. Yeah. Rather than someone yeah. who won't. That is true. Maybe the, I feel like the license would be probably yeah, no, no. bad. It's like it's already hard to get a driver's license. You gotta go through proper channels to get your driver's license. Yeah. There's people that drive with no license. Both, both of them kill things. Exactly. So, yeah. you know, also the point oh, you I said a long time ago though, about the army stuff. So people can enter an army at 18, so we mm -hmm. can't just make it an age limit thing. We gotta make it a license, bro. Yeah. Uh, so I saw a uh, stat yesterday. What thing do you think kills the most people under the age of 50 right now in America? Cars. Fentanyl. Is alcohol? Dog food. It's fentanyl. Dog food. Fentanyl. Yeah. That's yeah. the leading cause of death of people under the age of 50. Yeah, that's why that's why they're trying to cut down the border. Yeah, yeah. Through Mexico. Yeah, yeah, that's how they get it in. You remember what I told you? With the backpack full of fentanyl. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's crazy, crazy, bro. No, people been getting that caught with that. That is crazy. They said you get caught with that, that's 10 of them. You're not getting out. They said this shit like the crack in the 80s. You can go. So fentanyl's worse than AR 15s. Oh, yeah. One gun. The assault weapon ban banned a bunch of guns. The AR-15 is just one of the most talked about because it's the most popular semi-auto rifle bought in this country by civilians. But since Whoopi wants to go there, let's go there. First of all, mass shootings account for less than 1% of firearm homicides, and that's using the broadest definition of mass shootings. Then within those mass shootings, only 14% of those mass shootings were committed with an AR-15. And even smaller than that, AR-15s are used in only 3% of all types of gun violence. So Whoopi, Dang. the question yeah. you should be that asking is, is why are you trying to ban the one rifle most used by Americans for self-defense oh that is only used in 3% of actual legal shootings? And what Dang. is Joy Behart talking about? How many times do we have to tell you that AR-15s aren't automatic? They are semi-automatic, just like a handgun is. And guns aren't <laughs> autonomous. <laughs> That's what I'm saying, bro. People just speak on stuff that they don't have no knowledge about. Yeah. He did the research. He did. They just going up there talking about Brandon. Brandon. He Brandon. came with numbers. They were all feelings, bro. I'm telling you. That's why I said what I said. That's, 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 that's how you know, like, the media's message is one. Oh huh? That's how you know the media's message. Because people are get get these broad headlines on broad topics. And they'll hear what the media say and they think that's what they know. Yeah. They think that's, like, the facts. And, like, when people hit them with the facts, they're like, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. I but I feel my grandma on Facebook. She would be posting stuff every day, and I'm like, literally every single thing you've ever posted is false. She has no idea. Not like political things. Like uh, she'll be, it'll be like, this found. I'm like, no, grandma, that's not. That's not real, grandma. Yeah. Like it'll be like a Bigfoot thing. Yeah, so they right. found Bigfoot. I'm like, no. But the fact that people can go on these TV shows and have broad, like, just being, uh, this. They put the money up for it, though. Like, it's it gets big. views, bro. It, it yeah. brings people into the network. It's good for it's the network. Yeah, it's man, it's, 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 like, it's being, like, broad, what, it's being broadcasted to the masses, and this is false information. What, what, what does Tom say? It's all about money. Yeah, it's just crazy to me, man. Just like a handgun. And guns aren't autonomous. Yet she talks about them like they're human. The AR-15 didn't kill those kids. A person killed those kids and they happened to use an AR-15 to do it. The same way people have used handguns to kill kids. But there have also been a lot of people who used AR-15s to save kids' lives. So clearly an AR-15 can be used for good or bad. But Joy and people yes, like her are so brainwashed by the anti-gun lobby they think banning a gun using 3% of gun crimes is going to do anything. Actually, it will do something. It will make sure that the only people who have AR-15s are the very people we don't true. want having them in the first place. Exactly. This idea that we're going to ban a type true. of gun and all of a sudden our kids will be safe is quite literally the thought process of a child. Joy will be the same person screaming, ban handguns after the AR-15s are banned. So I'm sorry, Joy. You can get up there and claim the AR-15 killed all of these kids and did all that, 
but then you have nothing to say when we have AR-15s in the hands of good people who use it to defend kids. Yeah. So this idea yeah. that we're gonna ban our way to safety is just a child's dream. And yes, yeah, AR-15s too, too are protected out. by the Second Amendment. A well-regulated militia being necessary to the security of a free state. The right of the people to keep and bear arms <laughs> shall not be infringed. It didn't say only it handguns, says, it, it said infringed. arms. Guns are political. That's why I need your help getting this message to spread on YouTube by clicking the thumbs up button, leaving a comment to- They were saying Joe Biden, Joe by the NASCAR thing, and then the announcers, I think they're saying, let's go Bernie. So it's basically a way to still say Joe Biden. That's basically like saying fuck Joe Biden. Let's go, Brandon. Let's go, Let's go, man. Yeah. His name is literally Brandon. Yeah, this is a great video. I like this guy, man. start telling them my names or something. Bro, yeah. Bro, yeah, they said they want a Q&A. Uh, they was like, what's your guys' names? Like, I just want yeah, to know. Somebody they messaged me. watch us every day and they don't know But The problem with saying the name is, though, it's kind of cringe at the beginning. Hey, I'm Brendan. I'm talking. Yeah, yeah. Hey, bro. It's very cute. We made a full house video after we do something over there. No, we need. Hey. No, no, no. This is so cringe. I get out. We'll be part of the intro. That's the intro. And then you come out the door. Spreading balls, bro. Take glory. That is too cringe, bro. Maybe we can just pause. They said they want to give it a. We can have like a picture that goes up before and have everybody have a picture of everybody with their name. Maybe. Maybe. No, I ain't gonna lie. This is a Q and A. I think we could do a Q and A. I want to do that too, though. Because that's why I seen in the comments said we need a Q and A. How y'all? Man, yeah, how this happened, how this yeah. that. always that bro people message the website. Somebody message today, what are y'all names? That's they want to know our names, bro. Alright, we can do a QA and maybe we can post on the community page a picture of us and our names so people can just know. But we need to I don't know. The QA would be great though. I yeah, that's what we, we, we should do. Just say that at the beginning of the video, because not everybody watches no, the same video. We're not doing that. We're not doing that. You see what I'm saying? People click different videos. We should do a bio like this B. Yeah, but this <laughs> is definitely a great video. So, 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 so where, where do y'all stand with this, though? Like, y'all, y'all, are y'all for the guns? I'm pro guns. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What, what are y'all for, bro? You know, I, I, I want the rod, boy. <laughs> I, hey, I've been around too many niggas. I know if they ban that shit, yeah, I niggas gonna have that bitch. The gang niggas gonna have that. I know yeah, niggas that for sure. Niggas who's in high school. Yeah. When I was 14, nigga, it was niggas in high school having the rod in a backpack. We didn't have clear backpacks like they had down here in McKinley in y'all school with the metal detectors. Down south. Y'all didn't have uh, clear backpacks up, up north? Nigga, Tennessee is still considered the south. Oh, you're talking about, are you talking about Tennessee? Yes. No, you cannot. They didn't have that. You didn't have clear backpacks. Back 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 niggas, niggas but had. But other schools had metal detectors. We had the SRO. We had two or three police officers in our school. But you can walk around that bitch. With the raw, it ain't your bad pack all day. Yeah, that ain't gonna stop shit. Yeah, I, I, I actually that. like this guy's channel, man. If he has other videos, please like that. Shit, shit. I know fellas with 10 guns in their house. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, he got some straps back there, though. He got straps. He, he is not going to work at like a gun store or something. That's crazy. Oh, that that's that's a fucking armory, bro. He, he might uh, have a million know. subscriber guy. Like, he might have. Oh, he got two million? Oh, yeah. yeah, he got the money. He, he, he like might have it. Yeah, I like him. Take us to the range, I actually brother. Like him. Let us know what's to it, man. We got here. He probably an ex-soldier. 